we are back with a growling racing Gracie. That is going in the video, by the way. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> we got the log on, it fits. Uh, Gracie's currently getting the rest of the Brian Tooley bracketed coils on. She lost a washer, apparently. We can remedy that later. So we're gonna start mounting the turbo, finally. I know, we keep saying that. Now it's gonna go on. You can see how we set up our cold side. And uh, I don't know. I'm excited. It's Friday night, so we're gonna be in here for a while. The bugs are out. The shop flooded again. As you can see, water everywhere. Keeps water still over there. Water still all the way in that back wall because it's still raining. Colorful Colorado turns into Seattle, Washington in 2023. Newsflash. It keeps raining. <laughs> it keeps raining. So we will be back. Show you how this looks. We're making progress. We didn't think that these coils they might not fit perfectly because of the brake booster and my shadow in the way. We'll figure it out, right? We'll get there. <laughs> All right, so those coils were not happy back there. We thought about just sending it, but Holly just had that big old sale and we picked up a bunch of random stuff that we didn't need. So we're gonna end up using these, one of them, since we were using the Gen 3 truck coils. And we're gonna mount this probably, I don't know, right above the brake booster, put two coils on there, maybe two spares. Hey, we could carry spare coils on this. Maybe mount the other one that's in there, over there and carry spare coils just like that. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get that done real quick. So we got the turbo in, um, working on, Got Gracie got the air to water intercooler set up. And we had an issue because the first time that we set up the turbo system before 1.0 last year, uh, we had a stock truck manifold. So I'll insert that picture here. And now we've got this going on. We ended up cutting a little section out of the pipe so we could clock it the right way and make it fit a little better. And she's cleaning up the sawzall cut. We're gonna end up just using a coupler to put it together. So air to water intercooler fits pretty nicely there. We'll be able to keep the overflow tank. Got the radiator hose on, at least that one. We might end up just running it like that because Gracie doesn't wanna put a hole in her fender. If it does end up gassing us out, we're gonna go out the fender with a little kick out. And then we decided on this side, we're gonna run one of the brackets like this and modify it to mount to the Brian Tooley holes there, just so we're not hitting the brake booster. So we'll be back here in a second. Gracie hates the sound of the <laughs> grinding aluminum. Yeah. And look, there's glasses. She's not wearing them, but they're there. I, I wear them when I'm doing it, I promise. <laughs> so this is where we got tonight. Uh, turbo is mainly mounted. I got to get a little bit longer bolts uh, so it fits through fully. I don't like not having a full thread inside the nut there. Gracie got this all cut apart and we got this clocked the right way to go into the Brian Tooley Equalizer 1 intake manifold. Ended up securing this here. Uh, I don't have a plug on hand. We might plug that down the road, but right now it's just kind of thrash to get to race week. Uh, intercooler is all mounted and super tight. We haven't done the crossover pipe to the turbo yet. That'll be a tomorrow deal. And then we kind of mocked this up. These are the Holly uh, Gen 2 truck coil mounts, those little circular ones. Sorry, Brian Tooley but the coil brackets did not fit the height of the brake booster and I'm not gonna run a not power brake system with Gracie driving the truck. So got a few things left to do, obviously run fuel system, but uh, I know we keep saying we're gonna get to this stuff. It keeps raining here in Colorado. It has not stopped earlier. Our water was up quite a ways so it's, you know, we still have stuff to do under the truck, the transmission cooler lines. Uh, we still have to mount the 
passenger side or driver side manifold with a crossover pipe to tie the whole exhaust system in. So that's kind of where we're at for the night, but it's 11 o'clock at night. We're going to get some sleep. She has work tomorrow and she's going to be mad at me, but I'm going to keep working on her truck. <laughs> so she does not like me working on her truck without her. We still got the whole interior to get uh, back together. And it's dark in there, so yeah, got a bit to do. Back up a little bit more to get the race moss in there too. Right, 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 right. Gotta do the ten second. Yes. Okay. All right, we're we're we're. Thank you for watching today's video. Um, as always, thanks to my awesome sponsors. Uh, like and subscribe help support the channel, and we will see you guys next time. Bye.